This is the car before I've cleaned it. See how it's covered in dirt and dust and all kinds of crap <laughs> from the desert. And I'm just sort of living in it. But yeah, it's it's pretty filthy right now. So the dirt everywhere. Some more. It's from the place I was staying in Quartzsite. And I already got the bed and stuff out because I already started. There's my back window. And yeah, she's filthy. So I already vacuumed this side. You can tell because it's pretty clean. It's actually dirtier than the other side, but you see all the dirt. She's getting cleaned inside and out. Inside first, and then outside. Just never remember to take before and after pictures, so. I thought I remember to do it this time. See? <laughs> There's stuff in the handles. Just covered in dust. Look real good after I get done. There's stuff in every crevice right now. Hello. Hello. There's so much dust on this thing like this. It's gonna look really different when I get done though. Those needles got everywhere. Everywhere. I'm doing the back first and then the front. So when I get done, I'll show y'all the rest. Guys, I finished washing her last night. Very late. She looks so good now. Look how shiny. Wash, wax, the works. Looks so different. <laughs> Very proud of my work. Look at this. So pretty. See how shiny? I haven't seen her this clean in a long time. And I have another possible of why my uh, clunking is going on. I don't know if you can see it here, maybe, but if you look close in there, my brake caliper is busted. So it's a good reason why I might be getting brake dust all over that wheel and why there's a clunking. So it's either that or a combination of that and the control arm. We're getting ready to go to Uncle Curtis's because it's Memorial Day. I just wanted to give you guys a quick look at my beautiful car when it's actually clean and not covered in dust from the desert. When it actually looks like a car. Instead of when it's all, see? It's actually a very pretty car. It's got a lot of good features. It's got the latch system in the back. Yeah. It's got a nice beautiful moonroof, which I love. It's one of my favorite parts of the car. All kinds of good stuff. I just wanted to show you all what she looks like when she's actually clean and not being lived in. When it's supposed to be a normal car. You know, everyday use car. All pretty again. None of those damn desert pine needles on the floor or anywhere else. Yeah, 
So, I'll give you a quick look at the trunk. That's nice and clean. I'm about to pack stuff in here because we're going to, like I said, Uncle Curtis's. And he's got a pool and we're going to camp out for the weekend. It's going to be great. But yeah, that is my trunk. And that is why I have so much room. The only downfall is that lip right there. That lip makes it hard to put my legs in there. But other than that, it works. So yeah, I just wanted to show you all what it looks like before I pack more stuff into it again. And I will talk to you all soon. Peace.